On July 8th, the Taiwan Association for Strategic Assessment, or TASA, held a symposium discussing the development of UAVs in China and their threat to Taiwan. According to Taiwan News, in the symposium, the defense specialists said the Chinese Communist Party, or CCP regime, learned lessons from the war between Russia and Ukraine. The ruling CCP sees the importance of unmanned aerial vehicles, or UAVs. Specialists argued that UAVs are low-cost weapons, do not cause user casualties, and show high efficiency. They added that last September saw the widespread use of drones by the CCP's military. TASA President Hu Chunpu, a retired Taiwanese general, said the CCP regime has rapidly developed a large-scale drone force. He added that a few months ago, the CCP military started using long-range UAVs that can fly beyond Taiwan. Who believes that CCP UAVs pose a threat to Taiwan and regional security? If Beijing attacks, UAVs will play a key role in their plan. Expert O. C. Fu of the Institute for National Defense and Security Research, or INDSR, highlights the ability of UAVs to perform various functions. Specifically, UAVs can be used for reconnaissance, observation, attack, and to distract the enemy. Taiwan is also developing its own UAVs, including military and civilian drones. What's remarkable is that Taiwan's civilian UAVs can be used for military purposes and defense systems. By 2025, Taiwan expects to reach the production capacity of 150 Qinxiang attack drones annually.